Today I'm traveling from Vancouver to Taipei with EVA Premium Economy Class BR9. Today is October 10. I'm walking from domestic terminal to um, international terminal. Now I'm getting to uh, Plaza Premium Lounge. The, it's very roomy and spacious, and I think at this time of the year, a day is not very busy, and uh, it's quite empty as you can see. There's coffee and tea. There's citrus and mint water. There's a bar here. Here's some dessert. That's the chicken noodle. And that's the cream of mushroom. Some salad. There's another espresso machine. Coffee and tea. Fountain drinks. Fish ball noodle. I'm gonna get this. Oh, can I get a fish bar please? This is the green bean soup and congee and some condiments and stir fry noodle, fry noodle and lasagna Didn't eat any of, any of them and A lot of soft drinks that you can grab to the Sky Team Lounge since this is part of the Priority Pass collection so I am able to get in as well and this is the bra but if you watch any of my video from uh, departing from Guy VR you should see this lounge which I introduced before here is the group This is quite a few of selection of wine around here which you can help yourself. At this time of the day it's very quiet as well. But it will get crowded as the time goes. Here is the coffee and Davis tea available. There's soft drink at the bottom and there's beer as well. Some spirits. Again, they do have a uh, fishball noodle. Actually, this is wonton noodle. Continue with another table. There's a salad bar. And lots of sandwiches and cheese. Actually, the, at night time, the dinner time is a lot better than this morning. Or lunch time. This is the butternut squash soup. Veggies and rice. Um, that's actually turkey gravy and stuffing. Because this weekend is a uh, Canadian Thanksgiving. Then I'm heading 
into the shower room. It's really nothing really special, it's just quite basic, but uh, you just do the job. In the shower, I order some dumplings and uh, pork so mine. Cheers, I keep drinking. And next time I'm heading to the gate. sitting on 21M but I kind of regret I didn't pay for the pre-select seating on the aisles or window there's a decent amount of leg room even I'm in the middle and also I like they have a slippers provided but they are not super comfortable Great, and uh, they have the two nice dinner um, and alcoholic and non alcoholic drinks available. I feel so cramped here, I feel so tight here because there's two persons sitting beside me, and uh, if people are able to pick AC or HK, it would be a lot better. Anyways, I couldn't really do uh, any takeoff and um, arrival video because I'm not at the window but um, I do my best and you will put a lot of work for the safety video I think it is quite interesting and uh, they really want you to watch them I get a wet towel before the dinner service this is how it looks when it comes but it doesn't look very premium However, the, everything in general tastes really good, especially the dessert and the main course. And um, yeah, but I think they should be using a nicer dining ware. So I'm checking out the bathroom and uh, the bathroom has body lotion, body mist, uh, toothbrush, eye mask, and uh, ear box as well. Pretty good. I'm navigating the entertainment system. He has a lot of new release movies from Hollywood, Taiwanese, Korean, and Japanese. It's also, if you have a question about today's menu, it's also available. Japan, we are heading to Taipei, and uh, in addition to that, there, there's a catalog of duty free as well. This is the arrival meal, and uh, it has congee, some fruits, bun, and uh, frying with chives, and uh, I think it's condiments for the kanji. Some final thoughts regarding even air uh, premium economy, the seats, the 
foods, the service are excellent. I think it's one of the best products for a premium economy class. However, I think I will, I'm totally regret that I didn't book any IOC or EOC. And uh, yeah, I arrived in Taipei and um, thank you for watching and um, I'll see you guys next time.